Hi, happy to present at the virtual PCIM. Visit is the only company developing gallium nitride semiconductor solution with the focus to automotive applications. After long research, with top quality and reliability professionals around the globe specialized in gallium nitride, we concluded that the DMOR GAN is the right choice for high reliability requirements for the automotive industry. I also believe that this is already a common consensus in the industry. Looking at the inverter and chargers needs for automotive applications, we developed the direct drive D mode gun, which we call D power free gun. It provides the advantages of a D mode reliability with the benefits of off state power switch. As gun can reduce the cost losses of uh, energy conversion and transformation, it brings value to many aspects to reduce the e-car cost. Starting from smaller battery pack required, lowering the e-car weight and reducing the cooling system costs. OEMs already understood this and started to serial development of gun-based systems. One of the important systems of powertrain is the e-drive with the inverter and e-motors. When analyzing the e-drive system, it's important to look at the car driving cycle. Looking at the efficiency map, it is clear that there are many areas where the car operates at low efficiency over the driving cycle. These areas are in general at low torque and low RPM, which is where the e-car operates most of the time, as highlighted in black on the e-motor efficiency map. So we should try to optimize those areas to improve the system performance. Here you can see inverter loss map done by top tier OEM. Blue color represent low losses and red color represent high losses. The tests show advantage to the deep power free over the in complete inverter operating points. The low switching losses of the deep power free provides a greater benefit when operating at low torque when less current is required. The losses over the complete driving cycle can reduce the losses, the less, the losses less than 50% as shown in this slide. This was done by top tier one and the choosing driving cycle was WLTP. The specific test details are specified on the slide, but you can see clear advantage for wideband gap technology and especially to the power free uh, uh, solution with clear performance advantage that will affect the car cost by reducing battery size, weight, cooling system, etc. VSIC D power free uh, gun technology designed for electrical powertrains for automotive and it fits into inverters, chargers, and high voltage DC to It is important to keep in mind the following when choosing the right technology for your specific applications. Technology is developed for applications and not finding a use case. Reliability is important for automotive, so use the technology that fits your application reliability requirements. Think how it operates in the system and how easy it to design and manufacture. Think about thermal management and look for best performance to reduce total cost. VSIC is developing power semiconductor technology for electrical cars. Thank you.